What's up everybody? So in today's video, it is a snow day here in North Carolina. We got like six or seven inches, which is actually pretty rare for us. Uh, we're gonna have a little bit of fun in the GTR. If you are watching this video, that does mean we've at least made it outside the garage. Hopefully we don't do too bad. I just gotta get out here and then just drive a little bit over to a school parking lot. Hopefully do a few drifts and some donuts. All right guys, here we go. Uh, first time in the GTR out in the snow. I don't know what setting I should do it in. Uh, it does say save mode is technically snow mode. I know the older GTRs that used to say snow. Let's see what happens. Hopefully it goes well. It's <laughs> really funny. I know. Is that just a road or your transmission? That's the road. Just a... Uh... Well, we got traction. I don't know how low we are. Pretty low. Yeah, I, I feel like we're um, we're sliding a little bit. This is my first time actually driving an all-wheel drive car in the snow. Aside from like the Forerunner Tacoma, of course, but I've never driven a car that's all-wheel drive. So her car is front-wheel drive. We just drove that, I don't know, 10 miles like a year today. And uh, we had a little bit of issues, obviously some spinning. Doesn't sound that good underneath the car. I'm just in normal mode. Traction light just flickered. <laughs> We're spinning a lot right now. I'm on Michelin Pilot Super Sports with about five millimeters of tread. Just got traction there. I mean, it's there's definitely uh, some sliding. I mean, we're moving. That's sliding. Man, the snow is actually really thick. <laughs> Just be careful, you're on the other side of the road. Yeah. Uh-oh. Uh -oh. <laughs> I don't know how deep that ditch is, so be careful. <laughs> Dang it. Just the tires are kind of covered a little bit in snow. I think if I dig it out a little bit, we'll be able to get it out. You can see with the front tires as well. I was doing so well coming down here, but yeah, we are actually stuck right now in the GTR. If you keep turning them that way and it keeps sliding that way, do you think you could kick it around? That's what I was trying to do. Well, note to self, don't take summer tires in an all-wheel drive car out in the snow. Uh, it's crazy how winter tires in real drive can actually outperform this, but we are not, we're not looking too well right now. Might have to put my tow hook in and call the reinforcements. <laughs> <laughs> oh man. I had a lot higher hopes for the car. I thought it, I thought it would do better. We'll see. Just the weight of it and the slant of the ground, every time I go forward, it just slides back and the rear tire is on the grass. Everything else is on pavement. But you can just see my tire tracks. Given it gas, it just spun sideways.
I guess I'll try to back it right there and try to just go straight on the left side and make it up. Hey man, that's good. That's good. Yeah, appreciate it. Uh, hope I can make it up. I'll be right here, so. Yeah. That is it for that. Uh, he's gonna go ahead and turn around and uh, we're just gonna tell me back home. That is it for the GTR. So if you have Michelin Pilot Super Sports, even if you're in a GTR, do not take it out in the snow because it is utterly useless. You can see uh, these are the first marks They're sliding. I got barely into the grass over there and even just now it was just sliding sideways. And here is a look at the tires. Yeah, they're getting there. So hopefully I can make it this winter at least, but yeah. And right now I just slid like five feet right here. That is it. Now normally I'm actually pretty good at driving in the snow. We always take the Tacoma on the Forerunner out. Um, but you know, you can only do so much with the capabilities you have. And obviously summer tires is not at all the best choice at all, which I'm aware of. But I figured I'd at least just go down the road and try to do some donuts at the school, but that's simply not gonna happen. We're gonna get towed out all the way back to my apartment. Now, luckily, I'm right down the road. His uh, rear rim, though, is destroyed. He hit a curb earlier while doing some donuts and stuff. And uh, he's on a flat tire, his rear right tire. I uh, definitely appreciate that help. And I do feel kind of like an idiot bringing this car out in the snow. I'm sure some of you might have some opinions about that, but uh, you know, you gotta have some fun and give it a try. And actually, the, uh, the owner of Suburban also has a built Mustang, a Shelby, so maybe uh, one of these days we might get a race between the two cars. I think he said he's like six or 700 horsepower. We gotta make it home. We're almost home. And we don't wanna hit the brick thingies. Oh, -ho, front tires made it. Okay, so we got the GTR back home. Massive shout out to Brian with the Suburban rescuing this thing. Uh, I guess, needless to say, summer tires on a GTR are completely useless in the snow. Uh, it was kind of fun getting it out just to see. Unfortunately, I didn't get to do some drifting or donuts, so hopefully once the snow kind of starts melting and the roads are actually clear, I'll be able to go to some places with just a little bit of ice and maybe play with it a little bit. But honestly, I can see the comments now of people ripping me a new one for trying to take this out in the snow. But in life, you gotta try some things out, have some fun, just give it a shot. Even if you know it probably is going to fail, but it was at least worth a try. And don't mind the graffiti all over my car. My birthday was a few days ago and my coworkers decided to write all over it. But yeah, that uh, that was my adventure in the snow with the GTR. I think Mike is making one with the Tacoma today out where he lives, so that is definitely gonna be a more successful video. All right guys, quick change of attire. Got my snowboard gear on. Uh, we're gonna see if the Forerunner can make it up. Not bad. How you doing? Get away! Get out of the way! <laughs> Here you go. Take it up. Now go on. Go, go, Maddie. Go, Maddie. Grab it. Okay, good girl. Bring it up. All right. So next up, since the forerunner is stuck and things are starting to ice up, we're gonna scrape the driveway a little bit. Hopefully, at least get the forerunner out. But. Having fun in the snow. 
That is about it though. Clear a nice little path. All right, Ore Runner got out of the driveway. That section just down there is so steep. I know it does not come off on camera, but it is a really steep driveway here. That's gonna about wrap it up for today's video. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Unfortunately, the GTR was a complete fail. Had a little bit of fun once we got home playing with Maddie in the snow. And then just a little bit of work out the forerunner out. But that is it for today's video. Hope you all enjoyed it. Give it a huge thumbs up, smash the subscribe button. See you guys next video.